Hello, I'm Jonathan, and I'm going to give a brief demonstration of my virtual reality music controller. My VR music controller, which doesn't have a name yet, is basically a MIDI keyboard in VR, but modular. It's kind of hard to explain, but I'll try to show you, and maybe you'll get a grasp of it. So right now, I'm just standing in my uh, environment. What this environment contains is a bunch of instruments that I've created, or rather instrument controllers. So these don't actually play sounds themselves, but they send control data to my music program, which in turn plays sounds. So first off, I've built this sort of three-dimensional organ thing. Um, and each of these little boxes here represents a tone. But what's fancy about this thing is that uh, you can play three different tones on each box. So if I push one button here, I'm gonna have different tones when I go from left to right. If I push another button, I'm gonna have different tones back to forth. And then on a third, up and down. And I can play all these three buttons at the same time. And of course on both hands as well. Now the fun thing about VR is that you can use all of these dimensions to uh, control different things in the music. So for example I'm using the tilt of the controllers to control pitch bend and modulation, which in this case controls uh, a cutoff filter. So uh, let's play a little bit with this and see where it goes. so uh, that's something on this instrument. I've also created a number of other controllers. So one of these is the classical Thurman, which I think originally was this instrument that you played with your hands in the air. You would have one hand go up and down and the other hand go up and down and it would change the pitch and the volume of the instrument. So it's similar, similar here. So in this case, uh, the left hand uh, controls the volume, and the right hand controls the pitch. But since in VR you also have an, at least one more dimension to play with, I've also connected a ring modulator to the third dimension, so to depth.
in addition to that, I also have uh, perhaps the easiest instrument to understand for everyone and to play as well. It's the harp. Which you just drag your hand across and it plays this chord that you've chosen. And on this instrument I've also connected so that the further up you play on the instrument, the higher the volume will be. So up here it's kind of harsh, and further down it's a bit soft and mellow. You can also bring up this scale panel which uh, controls what tones are part of the uh, of the harp here, so just change to some other ones. So this is really simple to play for basically anyone that can wave their arms around. And finally we have these modular drum pads, which is basically a rack full of drums. In this case, an electronic drum kit. Uh, but the cool thing about this is that you can take any of these drums and you can pull it out of the rack. And then you can extend your mallets that are on the controllers. And you can play on these drums. And the idea of the whole program later is that you'll be able to sort of build your own instruments from scratch within VR. So it's going to be a bit node-based, you're going to be able to connect uh, control surfaces like this one to uh, whatever channel you want the sound to go out on and like what pitch you want it to be and then also to like what happens on the different axes of, uh, of the instrument. So basically the idea will be that you can build, like if you want to build a piano, you can build that. If you want to build a drum kit, you can build that. Or uh, maybe you want to build like this crazy three-dimensional space organ. Hopefully people will build way cooler things than I can do. So of course the community aspect of that is going to be really important. Oops. So I think that was pretty much it for this little demonstration. I hope you enjoyed it and um, I'll see you next time.